on uh, today's scrimmage and what you guys were uh, trying to accomplish and talk about the up-tempo pace. I think for our first scrimmage, you know, our first time really getting after it with referees, we did a decent job, we played hard. You know, when it, it yeah. became live action, you know, guys kind of, you know, scurried away from what we usually do in practice and everything. So I think that, you know, us doing this for the first time and us having the scrimmage a couple more times, it'll be more fluid and we'll do a good job. It looks like your jump shot was falling today. I mean, talk about what you're trying to bring to this team. Um, definitely scoring, um, just leadership and defense on, you know, just playing on both ends of the floor and, you know, just kind of helping this team win some games. You know, between you and Jahi, I think you guys both get up from the floor about two seconds apiece. Your thoughts about the speed factor that both of you guys bring? I mean, I love it. I mean, Jahi running the one, it gives me time to just kind of take off on a full sprint without the ball. So I think that, you know, with him running the point guard, it's just, you know, great to have him maneuver the ball the way he can. I know it's very early, but talk about the outlook about the potentially what this team could accomplish this year. I mean, I think the sky's the limit for us. We just have to mold together and, you know, build camaraderie and learn each other and remember the plays and stick together. Um, I was going to ask Kevin, as far as, um, you know, sitting out last year, obviously something that you don't want to do ideally, but what, what do you think, how has it benefited, do you think, this year? I think the whole thing was a benefit. I think, um, you know, playing with Jahi, playing with Bo, you know, off and on practice, we got to know each other and got familiar with all the plays that we're running this year, you know, man to man plays, but, you know, just having the time to sit out and reflect on my game from the past seasons and look at what I can do for this team, I think that's been a good, a good thing. I mean, you compare uh, this time last year, I mean, do you feel do you feel it's a different feel to this team compared to last year? Yeah, we're, we're close together, we're a team, the more we need to get closer and, you know, talk and, you know, work together more on the court, but after all that, I think that we did, you know, a good job for during the scrimmage. I mean, after two weeks of practice, I mean, what are some of the stuff that you're really encouraged about as far as uh, areas that the team is doing well? Uh, scoring the ball, um, defense. I think that, you know, we're putting everything together. It's slowly, but it's coming, especially from this whole rebuild with the coaches and the, you know, team leaving. So Everybody's excited about playing man-to-man -man defense compared to the zone last year. How's, how's that going so far in practice? It's going good. The, the zone's a good zone. It's just, it's, it's tough to play. It's really tough to play, but when you can do it, it's a great zone. But I think playing this year gives you more responsibility, and I think that, you know, it kind of puts more pressure on the ball. Would it also be fair to say that with the high tempo that you want to play this year, the man-to-man -man helps more in that regard? Definitely, definitely, because you'll, there will be more still opportunities, there will be more pressure on the ball, so that always helps out for turnovers and getting up and down. That's supposed to be like a different mindset for you. I mean, you know you're going to be the starter this year. I mean, that's obviously very different than last year sitting out. Right. Um, you know, it's, it's, it's a goal to play, you know, at the highest level. 